name's Frank Tillman. Maybe you heard of me? Can't say I have. Well, uh, I killed four men. Still don't ring a bell. Well, that's a scene from Forsaken. Kiefer Sutherland stars in the period Western, which is in movie theaters this weekend. And it's also a bit of a family affair. Tashana Reed is here to explain and to talk about Forsaken. So what makes this movie a family affair? Well, you know, as you mentioned, it's not the first time we've seen them on screen. Uh, the two shared the screen on uh, a couple of films, A Time to Kill in 1996, as well as Max Dugan Returns in 1983. But what is a first is it's the first time they're playing father and son, which they should know how to do pretty well considering uh, they share this uh, relationship but Kiefer has said that you know he's always wanted to work with his father this has been a dream of his for over 30 years you know since he started in the acting game and he said that one of the interesting things he never really thought of was because they were playing father and son when they were doing these intense scenes uh, he'd kind of get lost he'd be looking at his dad and he'd <laughs> remember you know some memories and he said I didn't even really think that that would happen it came up actually in an interview that the two of them did together and Donald was actually a surprise to hear these he's like really oh okay what are you saying um, but you know he said you have so much history with this person that you know actors who aren't related wouldn't mm -hmm. have that uh, natural connection so it kind of came up and uh, he said he felt very real emotion sometimes you know in a scene where they're saying goodbye to each other uh, you know fe the feelings that you would have um, and it is a Western we had a chance to speak with Kiefer about why he was keen on doing a Western and uh, here's what he had to say take a look Visually, it's a genre that I love. It's of a simpler time. Uh, things were more black and white. Uh, and for all of those reasons, it lent itself to a story that, uh, that I thought was really, that I personally thought was really moving. And I thought it gave my father and I a really great opportunity to show a father and a son that were deeply estranged in the beginning of the story and how they come together. So it just came in theaters this weekend, and it's also available on video on demand. Well. I love it. I, I love seeing father and son together. It's one it's of those. Cool. Yeah, it's a very neat thing to see. Uh, that said, uh, the movie itself. Tell us about it. Well, it's interesting. If you were a fan of Kiefer Sutherland in 24, well, this comes from the same director, John Cassar, and uh, Kiefer Sutherland plays this guy named John Henry, a very a typical Western <laughs> name, and uh, you know he has been fighting. He fought in a war. He was a gunslinger. He had a very violent past, and he's ready to move beyond that. So he returns home and he starts to, you know, basically moves back home with dad. That's his father. Now his father is a reverend. That's who Donald Sutherland plays and uh, very uh, different. And he's just trying to, to, of course, leave this violent past behind. But you know, there's got to be some bad guys that come into town, want to shake things up and they want him to dust off his guns. We see if he can hold off. And Demi Moore also in this film, uh, you know, and, and we haven't seen her in a while. So uh, we'll see. But the film is rated R, not for kids. Um, and uh, it really plays around the dichotomy of violent versus nonviolent, which which path he chooses. Okay, thanks, partner. You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome.